long way to fall. Stay alert. We don't know what's down there. It's stuff like this that makes everything worthwhile. Nice work. Activating automated forward station deployment. Car attack. Wait, are those Turians? Oh, there's on the Tannis uniforms, Pathfinder. A Turian arc?
Eidetic trigger, Sam? Yes, though my memory array remains locked. Additional triggers are required. Shot to the gut. Painful. I appreciate the help back there. Name's Avidus Ricks. Sorry if my methods seem extreme. Civilian life is... trying. Ryder, human pathfinder. You former military? A Spectre. Special tactics and reconnaissance. Did the Council's dirty work for 15 years. So you're used to being above the law. Well, good thing there are no laws in Andromeda, huh? The initiative was my retirement plan. Then Natanis hit the scourge and bam, woke up here. What happened? Where's the Ark? No idea. Had to break out of my own damn stasis pod. A fall like that should have killed you. Now, those pods are sturdier than they look. But most of the Turian population is still missing. Including Mason, our Pathfinder. Sam hasn't transferred to me, so he's alive. Just don't know where. He hasn't made it back to the Nexus. Knowing Mason, he's out there looking for me. Mason dedicated his life to Andromeda. He's too stubborn to die now. We need every Pathfinder we can get. The debris and stasis pods from Natanis are scattered across the sector. Between the two of us, we should find something. You go left, I go right? <laughs> something like that. Here's my frequency. Call when you find something. An alien, able to use Remnant. Never thought I'd see such a thing. What My own had a Remnant artifact. artifact.
She learned to open and close. Some you were saying something about the planet being in decline? It doesn't look like it, but Havaral is sick. It started here, uncontrolled mutations in organic life, killing some, turning others into poison. We're starting to see the same elsewhere. The planet's ecosystem is crumbling, slowly but surely. It's the monoliths. There are only two of them when there should be three. There's so much life here. Your vault must be working. In some fashion, most likely. But the monoliths are responsible for propagating the vault's instructions across the planet. With only two out of three monoliths working, the instructions are imbalanced. We've never tried asking the sages. You saw the projections for the planet's survival. What do we have to lose? Sages? Oral histories? On Mithrather. That old remnant edifice over there. They trace their families back to a time just after the Scourge. They believe isolation will maintain the purity of the histories by preventing contamination by modern thought. Basic sense. They probably don't even understand or care that Havaral's dying. If asking your sages doesn't work, we'll be back here. So what's the harm in it? The trek up Mithrather's teeming with Remnant. Most of us don't attempt it, but maybe you could do it. Follow the Remnant River and keep your head.
trust their giant ditch. Got it. Give this a try. Isn't his story worthless if it isn't shared? If the account of our past are kept hidden, they may as well not exist at all.
like we need to find another way. How is that possible? An alien? I'm Ryder, Pathfinder with the Andromeda Initiative, from the Milky Way galaxy. That does not explain how or why you are able to operate the remnant doors. It doesn't matter. You must leave. We do not entertain guests here. Havarl's in decline. If you tell me about the lost monolith, I can help fix it, reset the vault. With Ryder's help, Haval could be healed. Our birthplace restored. Isn't that worth something? It's lost. The memories of its location haven't been reclaimed. On Mithrava, we have accepted Haval's eventual ruin. That's a strange choice of words. What do you mean by reclaiming memories? One may occasionally remember a past life, if the conditions are right. What do you mean? We believe in reincarnation, an unbroken thread. There was one, long ago, who had knowledge of the third monolith. Zorai, a champion of the Angara from before the Scourge. Zorai's soul has returned and could be made to remember what it knew. But we have no contact with it. So you're saying there's some way we can make people remember their past lives? Souls retain within families. An object heirloom tied closely to that bloodline could cause memories to resurface. But it's not guaranteed. It has been known to happen on rare occasions in the past with other souls. The only known heirloom of Zarai's family rests in an area with active remnant. No one has survived the journey. But perhaps you, Zorai's soul was freeborn in Tavos, who is now a Roka. He recently returned to Haval on a mission. A Roka. Hmm, that'll be difficult. That's why you're here, Jal. They won't like that I'm helping you. This may be a dead end, but we have to try. I will send you the relevant coordinates. We considered Haval a lost cause. 
But perhaps now, there is hope. Sam, another memory prompt? One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Samnode on the Hyperion to investigate further. Esmus lets you wander around with no supervision? You're interrupting our lesson. Could use more interruptions. Sorry, I didn't mean to get in your way. And yet you're still here. As I was saying, the propulsion system that took Bashal to the skies was inspired by four remnant pieces. And that's just one. Much of our progress was prompted by the discovery of remnant artifacts. I think I'll leave you to your lesson. About time. Activating automated forward station deployment. 